Welcome back to SnowRunner, guys, and today we're going to be having a look at a man. Actually, we're going to be having a look at the Man TGS 480. This is a new mod that just recently got uploaded to mod.io, and it's interesting because we haven't really seen many mods like this, many mods with uh, this type of a vehicle before, but we're definitely going to give it a fair look, and we're going to see what we can do with it in the customization, and we're also going to be putting it through our standard round of testing. The, uh, the interior actually looks pretty dang good, and we're going to go ahead and fire it up, take it into the garage, and see what you can do in terms of customization. Fires up really, really quick, actually. Oh, look at that! You can see the drive shaft spinning, too. That's really cool. All right, so... We have, ooh, we have three different engine options. The Man TGS D15, D26, and D38. Now, the D38 gives us an S plus power to weight rating, so I'm definitely going to go with that. High range and off-road, I'm going to go with the high range one because I want to see how fast it is. And suspension, we have default and we have construction power. Whatever that means. I just know that it's slightly higher. And then we have the option of 43-inch tires, 43-inch tires, and 43-inch tires. Uh, literally, that's about all you get. Now, I... Whoa. Oh, that's interesting. It is high in the front. I don't know why it's so dang high in the front. I mean, that's fine, but that's a, it just seems a little bit, like, a little bit off to me. We're going to go with the Extreme Unstoppable Power Winch. Sounds about right. I mean, extreme unstoppable power. That seems about right to me. You can use the flatbed, van body, sideboard, saddle high and low. Either way, I'm probably gonna use I'm probably gonna use saddle high so we can actually do some, you know, trailer hauling. And we'll do the short round cap and engageable all-wheel drive system. Now, wheels-wise, we got MSH rims one and two. I'm gonna do two because it looks a little bit more like a truck wheel. And, whoa, apparently we've got, like, a digital camo set up for it. That's kind of interesting. Do we have any more special paint schemes down here? Oh, I like the orange. The orange actually is kind of cool. I, I dig it. I dig the orange. All right. Let's see what this thing is made of, especially with that insanely powerful engine, or supposedly insanely powerful. Whoa! Oh, I know exactly what I'm going to do. Yes! Yes! I know exactly what trailer I'm going to hook up to. This is how we're going to be able to test it. At least in terms of pulling power. All right. Trailer store. Heavy duty low boy trailer. It does feel like it's a very maneuverable truck. I've got to give it that. It's very, very easy to, like, maneuver around tight spaces. All right. So... Ramps are going down, and let's see. Well, what are we going to end up pulling? I definitely think we need to have something that, ooh, P16. Yeah, P12. P12 works for this. Trust me. Trust me, the P12 works for this. And I'm going to actually make it just a little bit more intense. And let's see. Old Truck Heavy Engine 2. Mud tires, and where's my, oh, heavy oil tank, nope, no, oh god, brilliant though, hang on, so high, spotlight, spare wheel, maintainer, okay, yeah, I'll put the tank on it, yeah, I'll put the fuel tank on it, now, as far as something to haul, this thing is gonna be very heavy, and so, <laughs> it'll definitely put that man through its paces, All right, let's have a go. The range. Should be lined up enough. Really? Oh, come on. All right, I'm going to have to brace the front of the truck. Nope, didn't want that. Uh, nope, don't like that. All right, I'm gonna have to brace the front of this thing So it doesn't try to like push the whole truck set up forward on me All 
Okay. Should be good now. Pacific P12. And now I've got to make sure I'm actually lined up correctly, which is a challenge in and of itself sometimes. Are you serious? Bro, are you serious? Oh my god. Come on. This does not have to be this difficult. Like, genuinely, this does not have to be anywhere near this difficult. Up you go. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. It's good. Ish. It's about as far up as I think it's gonna get. Alright, stop engine. Swap. No! Oh my god. Man GG has 480. Thank you. Now. Can this thing withstand the weight? I don't know. I really, truly don't know. But. It's time for us to find out. I definitely think we've got the rear suspension maxed out, though. Hey, it shifted up to second. I mean, and that's a big, that's a big deal already. The fact that it's like, ah, I'll just shift up to second. That actually is, um, it's a really good sign. But you can tell it is just having to work so hard. It has so much weight behind it, dude. It goes into high, though. Although, keeping it in a straight line is a bit challenging. Challenging is probably the right way to say that, but wow. Hey, it goes, though. I mean, now, granted, we are using the top-level engine, but still. It's pretty dang impressive. For, like, just, a, like, a 4x4 truck. I mean, look at what we're freaking pulling. That is genuinely impressive, in my opinion. Genuinely freaking impressive. And the mirrors work. That's awesome. I love the fact that the mirrors work. Love that. All right, get up to the top of the hill. Let's see if it'll make it over the crest of the hill without stalling out. Actually, it's just fine because we have so many contact patches on the trailer. Like, with the ground, we have so many tires. It, and they're so far up that it's not going to high center the trailer. I was really worried about it high centering the trailer, but actually, not even a big deal. Dude, it kept the trailer level around the corner. I mean, it's it's doing dang good. Really, really good. Easy. I'm just trying to make sure I get it around these holes. Because I know they're stupid deep. Get out of my way. It's going to be a little bit of damage for that, but I'm not really all con all that concerned about it. All right, repair and refuel. Now we've got another round of interesting testing to do, and I'm going to go over these obstacles, and I'm sure it'll make it over, like, sort of the little, like, log obstacle, but I don't know about the pipe obstacle. The pipe obstacle might be what does it in with the trailer. The maneuverability is so good. Oh, oh, no! Oh, now that I got the diff lock on, it goes. It started to sort of... It started to sort of lose it there in high, and, I mean, I, I completely understand why. I mean, there's a lot of bounce to it, and that's really, like, binding the axles. Uh-oh. Oh, I see what happened. Oh, God! Oh! Oh! Ah! I did not want to connect to that. I had no interest in connecting to that. Alright, well, you know what? Detach, because I think that's that's where the actual, you know, the actual part of towing that Pacific is gonna probably stop. Let's see how she do in the mud. Let's go. Oh, wow. Bro, that is high range. I mean, that's really good. That's impressive. Super impressive. Yeah, that is, like, super impressive. I know that's shallow mud, but still. Up the hill. Oh, my God! Bro! 
That is amazing. All right, I, 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 I respect that. I respect the crap out of that. Most semi-trucks would not be okay with doing that. Wow. I mean, the wheelbase is so short that it actually does decently well off-road. I mean, if the tires were a little bigger, it would be so much better. But again, I get that this is not really its main objective. God, it's fast and high. It is so fast. It's like, actually, maybe too fast for its own good and high. Like, I'm starting to wonder if it's too fast for its own good. Whoa! Do a barrel roll? Do a barrel roll. Oh. Do a barrel roll and a quarter. Uh, doing a barrel roll and a quarter doesn't really equate to uh, doing the job that I want it to do, but that's all right. I am going to use an ANK as my rescue truck because I've never had any issues with the ANK as a rescue truck. I mean, it's just... It's always there. It always does exactly what you want it to do. And now it's good to go. Alright, I want to change up the add-ons on this thing just a little bit. Because, let's see. What is that? Transfer box. Oh, all-wheel default. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Heavy construction equipment. Oil rig. Flatbed with ramps, service trailers, coil tubing, so much good stuff. Like, we do the flatbed. Let's do the... Let's do the van body. It actually looks really good with the van body. And the van body looks like something that I could genuinely see this truck using in real life. You know what I mean? I could see, I could see this being something this truck actually used in real life. And actually used you know, pretty effectively, and I am stuck on a rock. That, oh my god, that was a, that was a big old rock. Get out of the way, stupid five ton. All right, I'm gonna need high range now. Whoa! The suspension does have a bit of a weird bounce to it. I mean, I don't know. Oh god! Accidental clicking of the free camera button is not desired. Let's see if we can keep it in high up this little trail. God, you don't really realize how tall that, that sort of repair box is until you have to, like, fit it under things. Oh, yes. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. We'll be fine. See what I tell you, we'll be fine. Kick it and go. You know, I was going to do a yeet, but it it, it was not really in support of yeetage at that present moment in, oh, in time. I don't know how I get this lucky with this truck, but God. I wonder if it'll stay in high through the water. That's gonna be an interesting test. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh boy. Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. Oh. Not bad. Not bad. I can respect that. I mean, like, it's definitely an interesting truck to use, and I think it could be an interesting addition to sort of the realistic vehicles fleet. But if you guys enjoyed this mod test, then uh, let me know your thoughts in the comments. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. And I'll see you guys next time.